G'day, g'day. Welcome to another 1v1 on the couch. And I am spectating Sunbeam on the German team from Canada against Winterwolf on the USA team. So this is another practice game between the two. And we can see now Sunbeam pulling up an assault squad into the center with some single rifle bars. I, I rate that. It's a good thing to do. Seeing the singles, four of them to the right. And some single rifles and... SMDs to the left, so a pretty even split. Uh, the full squad is going down the center. Dwarf running into the STG 44 is okay, he nearly died there. <laughs> but he's gone to the center, and some of actually attacking from the side of the center, in the southern area. And Dwarf does, has an, does have an MD in a decent position over here. Additionally, Sunbeam can even come move some of his troops from here to there and go assault that area. But the MG is in the window, but wow, awesome grenading by Sunbeam, really nice flanking, maybe not a good idea to put the SDG-44 here with the MG there, and it's a decent visit, decent chance to flank with the SMG. So he's running into the SMG, unfortunately not dealing with that SMG, uh, sorry, dealing with the MG well, and on another point, looks like he's won the shootout with the majority of troops, so potentially move some of the guys in this uh, pipe as soon as possible, just run there and just send the guy to cap behind the tractor or just anywhere. And Southern Point is going to Sunbeam. Uncontested, it seems. Oh, no, it was contested by one guy. So the numbers really won the game there. I don't know if Winterwolf went single infantry, but the numbers really won it. Here comes an Assault Squad now from Sunbeam. I'm guessing it's Assault Squad. No, it's a regular. I don't rate that. It took a while to come out, and now Sunbeam or Winterwolf can now get a foothold into the center, but if the MG42 can get in here, potentially it could be a good position. And the big mistake I think with Sunbeam is not. He had a great start, did very well. It didn't take the opportunity to grenade that house area where the MG was. And lost maybe three or four troops putting the assault squad leader. So it matters. These little infantry battles do matter. Losing the SDG44 is a big thing. MG in the open. Now behind the back, like going to the house. Up in a good position. Nice one. Look at him there. He's not firing though. No, he's. It's reloading perhaps. And shooting down a bit to the center. So Sunbeam's got it now. It's a decent position to have it. Now the regular squad is now doing well because the MG is in a great position. Look at it shooting, pinning down everything. As on the northern point, the assault comes full squad. Rifles shooting. No one, no one dead. And Winkle will be able to overwhelm now with just the superiority of numbers. Thompson's are blazing. And the Rifleman are perpetually in cover. There it goes. Nice explosion. Taken out. Southern still in the hands of Sunbeam. And the center point. Nice grenade here by Sunbeam. Has he taken out the MG? And he, he has. It's on the ground. Oh, but still alive. It's going to come back. Let's see if it comes back and gets shot. So these guys are going to divert some of the fire away from that MG when it comes back. Oh no, it's still alive. It's, the MG's not firing at that. Should definitely start firing at that. Nice diversion here. <laughs> so the MG survived another day. It's gone back into the window and now can heal. So wow, that MG must have some broken legs or a really bad back falling down on that concrete. That's for sure. Northern point. Being assaulted behind this pipe. Decent uh, way to do it. I suppose. Nice spread though. Winterwolf. One there, 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 there. Not going to get an easy grenade off. Just got to win at the shootout. M1 Garand's taken out the Assault Squad leader. Probably shouldn't have sent the Assault Squad leader. We've got to keep it, really got to keep an eye out. Even though it's, it's just one unit, but it does matter. In the Assault Squad, he's the guy that should be shooting behind you, not this uh, MP40. If you can, um, if you can handle the micro, that's it, that is. Veteran Sniper out now. And could take out that MG in that window. MG in this window is still alive. Getting pinned down there by the BAR, the USA kind. And Sunbeam coming up from the laneway in the roadway. And potentially again this MG is in danger. Nice! Let me finish him off this time. <laughs> wow. That guy got crushed. The MG just doesn't die, does he? Let's see, now he's got broken, uh, a broken penis. He's landed on this front. <laughs> I'll track out. Can it, can it get killed this time? Oh no, MG42 hasn't seen it. 
that's not firing. Wow, that MG is got to be Chuck Norris's grandfather or something. Half track, going to the center. And pinning down that MG, really firing at it. Not uh, destroying it or doing much. It can't take out the buildings like a 222 20mm can. Two assault squads, no, it's a paratrooper or bad buy here, yeah? especially versus a half track. Overinvestment, I think, to an infantry squad. But they do have good aim. So potentially, they could outshoot the gunner in the half track if the half track uh, does charge it. Ooh, lucky there. <laughs> Winterwolf got out of his grenade, ready to throw it at this full squad. But no, he's got, got the point back, so it's not a 3 cap, it's getting close. Southern point is capped. Uh, I dare say, Sunbeam's probably going to be one of the most improved players in the tournament with the amount of practice he's playing, and he's look, looking like he is playing very well. I wonder what group he's in. I didn't actually rate him in the group he was in, but I'm curious to see. I'm going to check it out again to see who's group because he may actually make the top, uh, the top, the final 16, coming up top two, one of the top two in the group, potentially. Paratroopers. Oh. Being uh, shot at, they're already half health or nearly dead, I'm just running through that. But now they're firing and can potentially do some damage, as they are now. How many guys have perished? Just by the shootouts, doing well. Half track should definitely plug in that gap. And Brandenburgers, okay, so he doesn't want to fight the half track with a hard counter. He's got an AT rifle. Oh, this is why I hate AT rifles. They're just never reliable. Um, must have hit somewhere and bounced. No. Now, oh no, MG34, don't go too far. But now, Brandenburg of the Faust. The Faust. Panzer Faust. No, what are you doing? You're crazy. Wow. Okay, standing shot. Uh, was that direct controlled? If it was, impressive shot, if it was. Uh, MG42. Oh no, it's being stupid. Look at that. It's leaning. Oh no, not anymore. MG42, MG34, double. MG's down here will be so cool. Oh no. Why is it doing that? And that MG is actually leaning here. He's fallen down and he's just saying he's, <laughs> he's had enough of falling down of buildings. I'm going to just lean against this uh, door. But center, he has got it. Southern point, Sunbeam has lost now. And Lux is out on the field. Just no infantry to support. But he's sending the guys, or the Brandenburgers from the center, down to flank here. It's quite a good area to have the center to just use it as a springboard to either come down here, come down near the bunkers to shoot down on the southern flag, or come down to the northern flag and shoot down from the walls right there. MG42 or BAR getting pinned down. MG42 not firing though once again. Just really, really annoys me when the AI just leans against the wall right like there. Very annoying. It looks as neutralized the position. And Assault Squad is coming down to the southern point to take it. And looking good, so waiting for a counter, I'm guessing a Stuart. Nothing yet, so he's probably waiting for that to happen, waiting for the Stuart to come up, and the looks should really make advantage of this situation. Charge right down here, take out all these units, and maybe go even onto the northern point. It's quite easy in Bacaj to play Cat and Mouse, because all the buildings you can run away, run to the other flags, behind the buildings but he's out in the open it's quite dangerous now you can see winter spawn is around here you should keep it moving especially when you're here because you can shoot but once you get to the building area it's going to be hard for winter to take you out just make sure you stay near the buildings first shot will potentially miss of the stilt what's he got guarding this point uh just some assault squads and he's not capping it. Oh no. Soul Squad leader here. Just a few center. Uh, a step away from capping the flag. Has it noticed? It's unfortunate. May cost him the game. Sniper? Where's the sniper? Let's see if he's in a decent position. He's a sniper in a. Oh, he's out of ammo, is he? 
is out of ammunition. That is why. Uh, what's out? Croc already? Oh no. Definitely get the hell out of there, Mr. Wimple. Oh no. Sorry, Mr. Sunbeam. He's still going. Oh, I didn't see. He's blind. Brandenburger. Um, yeah, you should definitely also use the Brandenburg in conjunction with the looks. There isn't any. Should definitely be some sneaking already waiting for that croc to come out. Because as uh, you, USA, or as Germans, you know when you're fighting USA that the croc will be out very shortly, at around 9 minutes. And whenever you send your looks or your, weak, your weaker unit out, you can bet you the croc will be going there. So Brandenburger should be waiting somewhere. And finally capping this area with the Assault Squad Leader, I'm guessing. And center. Decent, interesting sandbag line here. Can shoot around here, there, and can potentially shoot around here as well. So a bit of coverage on both legs. Interesting sandbags. Never seen that one before. Goliath, what the hell? Oh, that's desperation. This is not going to work. This does not work. If it works, um, yeah, I'll eat my... I'll, uh, okay, if this works, what will I do? I will. Hmm. It's a punishment. What's it doing? Get in there. Okay. Um, it's running away. Oh. If this works, I'll do... Oh, no. Okay, never mind. <laughs> if this works, nothing will happen. Oh, look at that. It's actually pretty cool flaming. On Ultra. Wow. The flames look pretty good. Could actually use this for a, a video. Like uh, some sort of uh, animation. Very nice. Croc. In the center. And it's going to be deadly with the flamer. The flame all these areas. Behind the sandbags, in the buildings, and I think it's going to go for the buildings. Where is the Brandenburgers? Has he used them all up in assaults? Because they're only used for the half track. The Brandenburgers are really made to counter the Sherman, really. It uh, definitely shouldn't be running. There's nothing here. He could have snuck to here. Because uh, Winterwolf had infantry here and here. There's no rush. He could sneak up to here, fire. But it takes around 15 range or even 14, I think, to, to see it. Oh, a bit frustrating there. I'm definitely going for Sunbeam though, he's the underdog. Even though I've been friends with Wintour for quite a while. And a nice flaming action here, staying quite very far at around 30 range to do this. Safe from any Brandenburg assaults. Definitely, so nice play. Veteran Sniper has just been flamed in that building, he was there somewhere. And it's no good. Oh! Another Brandenburger squad coming from the roadway and just coming here, bam, and just running back. Wow, that's uh, very Brandenburger style. <laughs> just using the behind the line tactics. And well done. He's neutralized the croc with a charging Brandenburger. He uses the Brandenburgers very diff differently or very strangely. I must say, he was quite lucky to get the standing shots off these units. I was just, oh, he's actually used two. Too fast to try to shoot that. You can see, well, if you didn't see that, you can see, wow. He's used all four Panzerfaust to, to try to take out that crop. I guess one in four hitting is uh, is fair enough. So it wasn't lucky. Uh, he just, you know, played a numbers game, one more hit potentially. Or maybe, it's probably a micro issue to be honest, because when you hold, select your whole Brandenburgers, you just go, oh shit, the croc, you're just right clicking like crazy. Um, that's probably what I was doing, panicking. And one guy could have just snuck, just gracefully taken it out, and you would have three Panzerfausts sneaking everywhere. That's just my thought, and all, all what, hap what actually happened. Uh, M20, coming to the southern flag. 22 apiece. This is even. <laughs> Funnily enough. As, oh, that grenade went high. And definitely off the mark. Oh, I never actually realized this statue looks very pretty. I never realized this. This guy is in deep thought. And thinking about, man. <laughs> oh, he's, he's impatient. He's waiting, saying, man. 
Another grenade? How many grenades do you want to throw for over me? <laughs> oh, he's protesting. He doesn't want to catch any of the grenades by putting his hand on his uh, chin. Okay, enough of that silly banter. As a stuart, standard counter to the looks coming out. Looks get the hell out of there. I find Sunbeam doesn't respond to the counters too well in time. The priority in the entire map right now is getting the looks away and he hasn't noticed that. Definitely needs a bit more situational awareness. When this is coming, yep, that should be gone in an instant. He would have escaped, most definitely, if he clicked um, when he saw that. Or even after the first shot. But he uses the infantry well, microing his infantry and tapping the flanks. Almost a 3 cap now, 25 to 22. What is going on? Winterwolf not looking too good. Still coming up. Shell, nice. Oh, that's a Shrek. Another shot. Winterwolf hasn't noticed. He's trying to get away, but he's not going to. Wow, he's winning by the bazookas, but oh, it's flaming, and there it goes. Wow. No enough infantry. I found that last game in Dev as well. When it gets to the mid late game, Winterwolf suddenly just drops off with infantry. All of a sudden, uh, he has all the tanks in the field, but just. Yeah, infantry is just gone. He's got nothing. 30 to 22. Can he come back from this? He's going to try by going to the northern point. But no. Wow, Brandenburger MG34. Brandenburger's in cover. Going to struggle out shooting these guys, and they will. And another MG42. So two of the MG40... 34, sorry. MG34s. Another crack. Yes, it is. It is. It is. But no Panzerfaust. All of them have been wasted on the first croc. But he's got a Shrek. The Shrek's coming. Oh, it's trying to. Croc's being, uh, yep, pushing away. It's just no infantry to support it right now. Oh, 18 infantry's down, so here it comes now. It's going to do damage on its own now, potentially. There's nothing stopping it, I'm guessing. Veteran Sniper back here. Oh, what? He just crashed his own man in that building. <laughs> Look at that. MG, MG and everything. Oh. He's going to get the center. Red and Sniper, get the hell out of there. No Panzer Shrek. Panzer Shrek should have been waiting. Shouldn't be too cocky there. Oh, Shrek. No counter coming, though. There is nothing coming to counter. Oh! What? Crew injured? <laughs> didn't do a thing. That was bad luck there for Sunbeam. I don't know how he got the um, infantryman behind the crop to grenade it. But still alive. Ticking. Center's going down to Winterwolf. 42 to 22. And, oh, the G. This is a 50 50, most likely, in this uh, play. He's gonna do this. I say if Winterwolf loses this croc, it's over. But if Winterwolf survives, Sunbeam. We'll struggle to get back into this. Let's see this big battle. What are you doing? This is the crucial moment. Direct control, boy. No, direct control. No. What? What? What a shot. Brilliant shot. Um, nice. <laughs> um, you need more infantry, though. On the left point to reinforce and potentially some in the center to just help this G survive. But 46 to 22. Winterwolf needs assault right this instant. Can he cap this flag in time? I'd say, yeah. Not too many guys. The Soul Squad leader down, and he is capping it quite easily. Just running in there to support. The G could definitely be more aggressive. Flag's not ticking in anyone's favor now with the southern point neutralized. And. Hmm, that's coming out. Some more. SMG. SMG. And coming out with the superiority. Oh, actually, just being closer to the middle. 
Northern Point being assaulted again, and I don't think so. Oh, there isn't too many left, no? Not many Brandenburgers left, but he does have that MG34 in a good position, and guys everywhere. Yeah, he won't cap the Northern Point, as it doesn't look good for Winterwolf, as all flags are being capped, and this is a GG. Wow, Sunbeam. Well done to him. Slaying uh, one of the better play, a good player in the tournament. Um, he's definitely improved. I'll be interested to watch how he goes. Ooh, that's a nice shot there. Right. Action shot. Good game.